What's up folks, it's your boy MMG Smurf here, and today we're going to be doing a really quick tutorial on, this is like a quicker one, I did a longer one, and then we're going to do a really quick one on how to earn um, Bitcoin or Ethereum on the Tron blockchain. And this is really for D live streamers, if you have BTT, this is what we use, our BT, we use our BTT to do this. Um, so let's say we were on D live, let's go over there real quickly. Let's say we were on D live, and we've already done this today. <clears throat> so let's say we were claiming our BTT for the day. So you're a D live streamer, you're staking BTT. If you don't know about staking BTT, I covered that in my Twitch versus D live video. Um, but you're staking DT BTT, and now you're earning that. So go to our wallet. We see we got this BTT here. I've already done this once today. So, um, but we have what seventeen dollars of BTT still in this wallet. Well, gonna, we're gonna take some of this. So how do we get it to become Bitcoin or Ethereum? What you want to do is from your Tron Link wallet. If you don't have the Tron Link wallet, you need that to do all this stuff. Um, so download it and stop thinking that it's a scam. Um, click the exchange button in your Tron Link wallet. Um, <laughs> beautiful thing about the app, the application, and just that browser extension is it's in the application. The, this exchange is, is really dope. Okay, so now we scroll down until we find BTT and Tron pair, or you could do BTT USDT pair. Um, but uh, actually, the last video we used BTT and Tron, so this one let's do BTT USDT. So we're gonna go over here, and I think there's enough liquidity and stuff like people moving in the market. Um, so we're gonna sell this BTT, and we're just gonna drag it over here. How much we want to sell? This is the price of that BTT. BTT's high recently was about 0 .0003 um, something. So, but we're gonna sell 25% of that. That's four dollars. Actually, let's sell. Let's sell it. Eight dollars worth. We're gonna sell eight dollars worth of BTT um, into United States dollars at 0 .00029. That's the price. Um, and you can see this is it. And so if we put it in at this price, actually somebody's currently selling some at this amount, and so it's probably gonna go through, and then it'll bump us up into like an. Uh, yeah, no, that's still gonna be the current order. Our order is just gonna be sitting there if this takes up that whole order. Um, but let's do that. It's probably just gonna be eaten up immediately. I didn't see how much specifically their thing was. But I'll scroll down, you can see that order is currently currently pending. This will get off of pending in just a second. It went off of pending and was immediately eaten up because of that order right here. And now you can see this one is a little bit farther over green. Okay, the order's almost completely finished selling off. Um, so that's that portion. If you look at our wallet and we go to USDT, we have that $8 of USDT now in our wallet. Mm -mm. Okay, so we're going to take this, and it also costs quite a, oh, okay, I was about to say, it costs quite a bit there. There it goes. <laughs> but it adjusted the wallet stuff. So now, if we want, we could click uh, this USDT, and we could go to swap uh, with Just JustSwap. Um, or you can just click the Just Swap link uh, from your wallet. So I'm going to show you guys at the top here. So let's say I click the Chrome extension, or if you're in the mobile app, you can just click Just Swap too or it's, it'll be in the discovery section as well. But you click, click Just Swap, it's justswap.org or justswap.io. They're the same website. Um, so you click that, it'll take you here. And since you're logged into your wallet, you'll be able to see all these balances and stuff. And so we're gonna find USDT, and we see our eight there. And then we're gonna select the token that we want, which is BTC. And if we want to make sure that this is, oops, not BTC, we don't want Bitcoin actually in this time, ETH. We want Ethereum. So there's all these uh, fake ones, right? This one says ETH, this one says ETH. ETH. Okay, uh, the correct one is this one that I have a balance of. But let's say we didn't know that. Let's say we just wanted to find it. Um, so how could we find it? To find it, you could go ETH, and then you can click on these individually, and you can do the exact same thing from the other way that I'm gonna show you. Or you can visit, go to this portion, Tron Scan tronscan.org and type in ETH and then you can start exploring these individual ones that are called ETH and so this one's called ETH on Tronscan so I clicked on that whoa this one looks pretty official this is actually the official one it's kind of funny because um, there's some fake ones the fake ones will also pop up in here if I started scrolling down but uh Tronscan's a great this is where you're gonna head to anyways and if you were on just just swap and you wanted to get the Tronscan on and check that token at the bottom here, not on the side, but at the bottom, you can click on that and that'll take you over here. 
And so now we're in the exact same area. We can check out the code. So a lot of this code is open source. And usually if the code isn't open source, it's a bad sign. Um, like you probably probably scam if the code's not open source. Uh, and then what you want to do though is copy this contract address to make sure it's official. So you're like, okay, that this looks like the official one. It's got all the transactions. It's worth the amount that it's supposed to be worth. Blah 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 blah. Um, cool. Um, and oops, this actually doesn't show you the amount right here. What we want to do to check the amount would be click on that right there, and then it'll show you the amount that it's worth. 518 USDT, which is the current price of Ethereum. Uh, so again, over to the right. Same way it was on the other page, you're going to see that contract. I can copy that and then I'll paste it over here into the thing that I want to swap into. Swap, it's trading, but it's swap. Um, and it, it won't let me select it right now because I have the correct one selected. Um, so good to go. Um, bu -bu 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 -bu. I forgot. How my, oh, we're using USDT, not Tron. Cool. So here's our USDT. We're going to push max to get the, the max amount that we sent over there. And it's gonna give us 0 0.016 Ethereum. It's gonna cost us this much USDT to do so. So it tells you the trading fee and everything. Once you push accept on that, this button, this thing will pop up. If you're in the mobile app, it's gonna ask you to sign it. Like you need to type in your password again and push accept. But if you're in the browser, it's just gonna pop this open and you have to push accept button. Now you gotta wait a little bit here and then it's gonna say confirmed. Yeah. And it usually goes really, really quickly. If this was Ethereum, that would be like at least, it's usually like two to five minutes on Ethereum. So it's a little longer. Um, but there's that. And now if we look at the wallet, great, this is going to come in right about seven minutes. Now if we look at our wallet, it's going to show our balances going down or whatever because it's not showing your Ethereum in United States dollars. It's just not synced to the wallet yet. But you can see that our total of Ethereum has gone up for 0.016 Ethereum, which is the exact same amount they told us they were going to send us. So success. Um, so you can do that exact same thing to get Bitcoin um, from your BTT with DLive stakes. And that's how we utilize our DLive staking to dollar cost average into these different assets that we want on the Tron blockchain since they're now available that way. It used to be a little bit harder. Um, but that's this video. Um, I'm not a financial advisor. None of the stuff that I offer is financial advice. Simply education and letting you guys know Money Match Gaming's journey with this type of stuff, how we're able to provide for our prize pools. So hopefully you find it useful education. If you did, um, like, subscribe, whatever you're supposed to do on this platform. And uh, see you guys next time.